I'm here in two capacities. Firstly, as the, the head judge, which was a whole lot of fun. But secondly, representing Rotary Sunrise, who are part sponsors of, of this youth camp. It's the second year we've done it. And I think on behalf of Rotary Sunrise, I'd like to congratulate and thank the Youth Services Unit, Catherine and Jamu, and, and the rest of your team. Unfortunately, I don't know all the names. Um, but being involved in both, I saw what happened last year. This year is a step up, I think, largely thanks to the Ritz-Carlton right. for, for the help they've given. It will be a ten dollar fine for the phone going off. So um congratulations. as I said, you know, big thanks to the Ritz. At least it gave the campus an idea of what it's like to work in a, in a professional kitchen. Um, I think one thing I would really like to encourage you to echo the words of Chef there when he said, you, you know, there are a lot of you that do a real skill. And I can honestly say in Cayman, and I'm an accountant as well, but we have way too many accountants, way too many lawyers, and way too many bankers. We need people in the hospitality industry that were born in Cayman, or at least in the Caribbean. And, and so I'd really like to encourage you to follow your dreams, and if you've got talent, speak to the HR department, whether it's at the Ritz-Carlton or at any of our other leading hotels on the island, because it's a real passion and a real skill to be in the culinary industry. So I really encourage you to do that. <laughs> and I think lastly, I'd like to say it's been a pleasure again. So certainly from Rotary Sunrise's point of view, we'll be back next year to help you. I can say, I mean, um, Vice President Joey's from the other Rotary Club, what we call our mother club. And uh, I think certainly speaking on behalf of all the Rotary Clubs, we've got a big focus on youth this year. So anything that we can do to help the youth in Cayman find a vocation, keep out of crime, and learn the talents of, of some of the people on this island, we will do anything we can. So thank you very much for that. You can give out the medallions, Miss Valerie can give out the gifts, mm -hmm. and then they'll pose with a picture with the plaque, which would um, they'll have the names etched in it. Remember the winners? <laughs> okay. <laughs> the, winner, the winners of the challenge today are. And go, if I could just say something. <laughs> <laughs> going, going back on, on Monday was won by Team 2, Tuesday and Wednesday, Team 3. So I issued a challenge to Team 1, and they really came up to the challenge yesterday, and they won yesterday. And I'm really pleased to say that the winners today are going Team 1. Yeah!